many people believe that EA is the worst gaming company in America. If they had NCAA football, th they possibly wouldn't be. Like, NCAA football was such good games. They always came out with such good games. <clears throat> but, as we all know, they're EA. They're EA, so they're always going to screw this up. And they did. And everybody says Ed O'Ban killed it. I'm here to discuss a couple facts. Alright, so without further ado, let's get into the video. Oh, and this video get his 10 likes. I'm going to make an NCAA basketball video. So don't forget to subscribe, hit the like, like button, and ring the notification bell. Alright, let's get into this. NCAA football was one was EA's probably best selling game on the market. No other could top it. Not even Madden. But as y'all know, Madden's trash now. Thanks to Madden at level 13. Thanks to Rex Dixon. Well, I shouldn't say Rex Dixon, but. Thanks to the programmer of Madden at level 13, Madden is horrible. Whatever program Madden at level 13 is does not know anything about video games. Alright. So. NCAA football. Was. One of the best games on the market. It was possibly the best sports game on the market. There are, there were years where NCAA football taught Madden critic scores. And then all of a sudden. In the 2000's. When EA is going there with Madden. NCAA football kept producing and making good games. And then P and PS3 continued to make good games. They or they continue to make great games. As for Madden, good, but not but not great. Alright. So and then NCAA and then Madden 13 hit. That left the door wide open for NCAA football to pass through and be able to say that it is better than its older brother of Madden. That's when it collapses. Not like in a video game sense, but it does something horribly wrong. It does something horrible. It does something horribly wrong and I really don't like talking about the NCAA football series, but I had to do this, so. <laughs> they used player likeness. They used player likeness. They used a player's image in a, in a game. And which, why is that such a big deal? Because it, because it, in the college football, they're, in college sports, their scholarships state that a player's likeness is not allowed to be in the game. You can come up with some fake names, like in NCAA Football 11, where they where they call called some people, where they called every single player in the game a different name than what they usually were. Like they called they called Andy Dalton, um, something Mc, something Montgomery. So, yeah. You get my point here. They use the player likeness in the game. And that ruined the series. And that has ruined all of it. So, and Ed O'Bannon finalizes a deal. I got an idea. Alexa! Play O Fortuna. Carmina Burana, o Fortuna by London this Hormonic symbolizes Russia. the fall of what happened in NCAA Hormonic football. And David Perry on Amazon Music. Give me music. Let's take three minutes to listen to this. Yeah, that is what happened at NCAA football. 
I mean, believe me, even this music gives me the creeps. I mean, EA completely screwed NCAA football, and Obey never killed it. Because his loss was reasonable. As for EA, they they use player like this in the game. It's their fault. And EA is dead. Forever. Let's take another minute to listen to this. I was rather stop the video, but Alexa, stop. Alright, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. Ring the notification bell. If this video gets 10 likes, I'm making an NCAA basketball video. Woo!